Hey, what's up guys? J7Wilson7 here, and today I've got you a little search and destroy game on derail. I guess a little bit more of a serious tone uh, than the last uh, video that I put up on LGU for my first one. Uh, it was the, uh, of course, the, the infamous PP video. I, know I got a lot of comments on that, way more than I just, uh, that I had initially thought I was going to get. And uh, I know a lot of people liked it, but uh, some people are like, oh my god, I feel like I'm in second grade, he's talking about his PP. I mean, I don't see why people can't just lighten up and have some fun every once in a while. Um, you know, have a little bit of different style video up. Uh, I think people should enjoy it. You know, it's something different than just your everyday commentary. Uh, and I think most people did, so I was happy about that. But anyways, with that behind us, um, doing two unusual things today. And one usual thing. My usual thing is I'm playing Search, which uh, I like to post. I post a lot. If you go to my channel, I, I post a lot of Search games. And uh, two the, the two unusual things that I'm doing is I'm um, using the Mini Uzi. Uh, that's unusual for a pretty much Modern Warfare 2 in a whole. You don't really see this gun a lot. Uh, I know some people do use it, but I haven't seen it very much. And, um, you know, I just don't think it's a very used weapon. I don't think it's that bad. Uh, it is kind of weak. Uh, but I don't think it's that bad of a weapon. And the other thing I'm doing is I'm actually playing on derail. This map gets voted about 85% of the time, and I think a lot of people think of it as the worst map. Uh, but it didn't get voted, and I put a good game up on it, uh, so I thought that made it even more of a postable game. And right here, that guy just got shit in his face. He did. Uh, he. I don't think he knows what happened. I, oh, I just jumped on his ass. That that's pretty sexy right there. I, I just want to replay that, but I can't. But anyways, that is my strategy for rat shooters. Sometimes it works, and sometimes they shit in my face. But <laughs> for here, it went ahead and worked. Now right here, this guy was diffusing while this other guy was actually trying to uh, cover his back. And you see, I just barely missed killing him here before the round was over. But uh, you can see him in the game. They're like, dude, I thought you had my back. And he's like, I'm sorry, I tried to kill him. And they were like getting all pissed at each other, <laughs> but it was kind of funny. Almost ended up killing them both. Uh, but I escaped the first round there with four and zero, oh. and then right here in the second round, uh, so I'm going to escape death right here. Uh, somehow that didn't kill me. These guys knew to have been off the spawn the whole game. Uh, but then you know I take my normal route up over this way. You know check the right, check the little tunnel over here. Nobody's there, so I'll go ahead and go through. And this time they had a claymore waiting for me and it uh took me out. Now guys, this video was insanely long, so what I'm gonna do is uh the two times that I die early in the round, I'm the first one dead twice in the round. I'm just gonna fast forward it, let you see the round winning kill cam, and uh that be over with it. Uh this game's gonna have a lot of super fast modes in it too. Uh but I had to completely cut those parts out for it to be under time limit. So uh See, as you can see here, I super fast mode this one. I throw my care package that way, so I take a different route all the way down through this tunnel. I come back up, and this time a guy was uh, already up here uh, trying to cut off my initial route, and I'm able to come up behind him and take him out. That's the kind of things you got to do in search. Uh, one reason why I like to play it a lot when I'm actually trying to get good games uh, instead of messing around and getting kill cams and stuff is it's a big mind game. Uh, y as you can see, those people were coming after me, trying to flank my spot. Uh, trying to come in a different route uh, than they knew that I was coming in so they could get me. And, you know, I just take a different route, come up behind them, and I'm able to take them out. And if you can consistently do that and consistently win your gunfights when you are in a fair battle, you're going to post up some good search games. And I believe that's why I like it and why I'm able to put up a lot of good games when I actually try to do so. Um, so here, you know, I come in the back way and then plant the bomb in A again. Because it's fine if I plant it again, it's about to be half time after this anyway. So I might as well just go ahead and plant it and get it over with, and they won't be uh, even more of them trying to come over here and bust up my route. So you can see this last guy left, and somebody calls in a UAV. I see him over here, and I see him trying to rush around this corner, so I'll go ahead and come over here and take him out real quick. Uh, jump around the corner and surprise him. He probably wasn't thinking of anybody coming that way that fast. Uh, so went ahead and took him out and I love how sometimes their gun like falls out of one hand but they're still shooting both guns I don't know it's kinda weird I don't know if that was a glitch uh, that's uh, probably in this game which uh, <laughs> amazing there's a glitch in this game right but that's something there that you know it's just always kinda weird catches your eye 
Uh, and right here, I didn't speed up this b opening round because I wanted you guys to see an opening round that I r uh, opening route that I really like. Uh, you come up right here on these boxes. You can see people to the left over there where that sniper just shot me from, and down to the right where I'm going to get shanked from. Uh, see if that sniper wouldn't have shot at me, I probably would have got a double there. But instead, I get this uh, perfect little kill cam where this guy just nice me, which is great. And as you notice, every time I die, we lose. Uh, so we lose this round again. One of the fast forwards where I took you straight to the kill cam. And this time I'm going to go ahead and go super fast mode. I'm not going to go to the same place because the sniper's obviously going to be looking for me there again. Um, so I'll go over here and I'm trying my third mini Uzi snipe of the game. I <laughs> don't quite get it. Uh, but I get this guy here. And then I'm going to try the snipe again. And bingo! <laughs> That's three like long range snipes with this thing already. It, Earlier you saw when I was kind of talking through it, there was some, some long snipes with the Mini Uzi. You just kind of burst fire that bad boy in there, and uh, you really don't have much time to move. I mean, they probably, if they were, you know, keen on it, they probably could have jumped out of there really quick, but they both just kind of stood there, or all three of them just kind of stood there and uh, took it. They took my Mini Uzi to the face, so, you know, I'll take it. And uh, you just kind of run around here. Derail is such a big map. I think that's another reason why people don't like it. You know, you're just kind of really s searching for people. Um, but one thing I do know is most people like to go to B. So I'm just going to run in here straight to B and try to, uh, you know, get some people going to the bomb because that's what they like to do is plan it. And there's not anybody over here yet, but I know that most likely people aren't going to go to A. So I'm kind of you know being cautious try to set up a little camp around it uh... keep looking around for anybody coming in and then this guy finally comes in and i know i don't need to stay in the same spot so i go around back and whoa mr sniper was hiding over in the trees uh... so i get the care package on him well, there's the last guy left and uh... he is in B right now and he is about to get hard scooped to the max by the only guy i was playing with this is actually a guy that i work with and uh... let's just say he's not the best of players Oh, but it was late. I think it was one night after we got off work. Uh, I get off at 1 o'clock in the morning, and we just got... I told him I was going to go get on for a little bit. And he was like, all right, he'll go get on or whatever. Uh, so, you know, I don't mind playing with him because, you know, in a search game like this, if he doesn't get kills, you know, that leaves more for me anyway. Uh, when, I, when I'm going try hard like this at, you know, this time of night is when I usually like to try a lot. And it doesn't really matter if my teammates get kills or not because I can usually grab most of them myself. Uh, so right here I shoot this guy, <laughs> come up the ladder, and he had jumped down to try to get me. Uh, That's pretty funny. And uh, he was down, and I was up, and we switched spots, and I took him out. And right here is a predator fell. don't see anybody, but I see these two cold-blooded guys, or I thought were cold-blooded guys, they're actually called teammates. And um, yeah, I missed them. <laughs> well, actually I hit them, but uh, I didn't get anything off that, didn't get any hits. And now they both get mowed down right here, and an enemy care package drops down right in front of me like a gift from the heavens. And I was like, yeah, somebody's going to try to grab it, and I'm going to get them, get my Harriers. But uh, nobody comes, and then I'm getting shot from over there. So I'll run around, try to flank this guy through, uh, back behind these rocks. Can't find him, don't see him, and then his teammates are going to come up behind me and UMP me in the butt. And uh, that's my last death of the game. Right there, I think I'm like 13 and 3. So I knew I didn't really want to post that because that's kind of fail. And plus we're going into overtime here. Once again, every round I die, we lose. And those are my three deaths, three rounds lost. Uh, so this game I'm coming in and I'm going to take the usual the rush, rush right there. I get in this little peekaboo match around this corner of this guy. And uh, somehow I finally run around and I'm really not sure how the mini Uzi won that battle right there. But uh, I don't know, he must have just been... You know, taking a snooze over there in the snow because I'm able to take him out and I got really lucky right there that I didn't just die and that end a postable game. So if I'd have got thirteen and four, that that wouldn't be nothing for me to for me to post with a fail, even if we won the round. So I'll come over, chase this guy down, and then I'm gonna go super fast mode again because I'm pretty much just searching, 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 because it's search and destroy, you get it. Ha <laughs> ha, that's a good one. Uh, but anyways, I'm running up here, and this guy is just going to pop out of the trees like, what's up? And I'm like, what's up? And then, you know, I kill him. I see this little sniper poking his rifle uh, out of this top. I think he busts the window or something here in a second. And I see him, 
See his gun pointed out. Uh, he must have shot or something before that, because I heard him, obviously, and I came back. And he, he busts the window, and I knew he was right there, so I throw it, and then I see this last guy, and I don't know where he went, and then I see his head popping over there. Didn't have time to reload, got about a fourth of a clip. Then he turned around, saw me, started shooting me, and the magical last bullet takes him out. Get like five kills that round, I believe. End up going 17-3. and three. Pretty high kills for a search game. Wish I wouldn't have died as much, but... You know, it's still a really good game with a mini Uzi on a big map uh, to top it off. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you think, and I will see you guys later. Peace.